So yeah, we're in Zanrak, and I should have gone to a city. Oh, data set. Uh, da, 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 da. hold on for me, Danny. X, X, I, me. Um, server data center list. Okay. Yes, cookies are fine. Um, Behemoth. Behemoth is on Primal. Ah, uh, Denny, you're on the you're on the other data center. Can you right across data centers? Okay, so it looks like, unfortunately, Danny, I'd like to help you, but I can't. You can do cross servers, but you can't do cross data centers. We're on different data centers. So unfortunately, you're stuck with a long VPS queue. Oh, tempered order. order. I, I know where these guys are. They're up here. Guys, I need, I need five of those guys. Five guys. Oh, the order is the black mage, so. <clears throat> No, so the way it works is there's, um, there is a different European data center. Uh, actually, there's a couple of them. So the way it splits down is instead of, like, other MMOs, like, I'll, I'll use WoW as an example because I know exactly how it works. So Blizzard has, for WoW, um, a single North American, uh, set of servers, and then a European set of servers, and then an Asia South Pacific set of servers. So all of your individual server names, like when uh, when I was playing, I was on Rexar, and I started on Manara. But they're both North American. Or they're both North Amer North American servers or under the North American server set. Now for 14, it's a little different um, because what ends up happening is. Uh, we actually have two different sets of servers that are both North America. So basically half of the servers for North America are on Primal and half of them are on Aether. So it's two different sets. Um, now there's also European ones and Asia and I think there's a set that is just China. Like, not even extra parts of Asia, just China. Um, I'm not sure out of North America how exactly they all work. Uh, I just know that 
we have two different stats. So it depends on your data center. Cause I just looked, I just looked up the list. Wow, paralyze is super annoying. So while they are both North American data centers, they don't they don't cross over because they're separate. Should be, yeah, that's all my tempered orders. Okay, so we are in Southern Thailand. The Northern Thailand is the other one, but I want to make a stop in Ulda because I have to clear out some inventory space and apparently I have to go buy more stuff with the seals because I'm out of space for flame seals again. I think it was flame seal, so I'm not. I, don't, I have too many of. Yep, 50k. I'm not maxed out on tombstones, though. So, um. What do we want? What do we want? What do we want? I got all that stuff. Oh, wait. Wasn't there... Borax? I thought that was... I thought that was a company name, not just a thing. Yeah. can't buy it because I don't have inventory space. Hold, please. <laughs> Hold, please. First off, Mender. 495 gil, that's a nothing. You there, proprietor. I wish to sell you things. I'm interested in this. <laughs> I saw somebody's tweet the other day. That, that's, that's what it said. It said, I'm interested in this. And, of course, the first thing I think of is Alucard from <clears throat> Symphony, Castlevania Symphony of the Night. Every time he goes to the library... There we go. Every time he goes to the library to buy stuff, and you click on something to get a detailed description of it, that's exactly what he says. He's like, I'm interested in this. But every time I see exactly that phrase, it's the only thing I can think of. And it's the voice I read it in every time. So anyway, I'm, a, I'm a full up on flame seals. I already have a Regan Pepper. Which would allow me to change Artax's skills. So we're going to buy some emotes, because there's no reason not to. And there's only three. So now I will learn two of them. Where, where'd he go? Here's one of them. I have learned the emote Reflect. Slash Reflect. That's it? I thought there'd be like 
something with it. All it says is in the chat, it says you take a moment of silence. Yeah, Symphony of the Night is one of my favorite games. Or was one of my favorite games growing up. Especially because I did it right the first time. Um, you learn the emote attention. Slash attention. Oh, hey, there's some movement. Okay. Now we have no flame seals. Two and a half million gil. Only one venger. 67,000 Mandervale gold points. Golden saucer points. Uh, 1,500 tombstones. Some of this stuff. <laughs> well, technically, this this Kojin Sanjos are each worth a venture. I think. Maybe it's two per venture. So we're going to go talk to our retainers and sell things. We'll put stuff up for auction. Because inventory space is a premium. Yes. Die monster, you don't belong in this world. It was not by my hand I was called again and given flesh. I was called here by humans who wish to pay me tribute. Or the uh Dracula's phrase of what is a man? What is it? A sack of flesh and bones or something like that? I forget what the rest of the quote is, but... <clears throat> That's one that sticks with people a lot, too. Okay. Craftsman cunning. 24.99. So, 24.95. I'm interested in this. Eighty eight ninety. Right? Eighty nine ninety one? Yeah. Hold cheaper. Strength two. Nine fifty five. Nine fifty. Savage might. Wow. Ten thousand? For a level one materia? Well, almost ten thousand? That is crazy. I would like to sell this, please. Yes, that's it. What is a man? What a miserable pile of secrets. It comes after the rest of that phrase. So there is the rest of that speech. Tribute. You steal men's souls and make them your slaves. Perhaps you could say that all, to all religions, or of all religions. Mankind is need a savior such as you. Yeah. Yeah, that, uh, that's a great game. And that started that whole version of the, or kind of the revamping of those Metroid-style 2D... Yeah, those like metro style 2d games like they went away for a while because you know you could do so much more with anything beyond the nintendo and that just kind of brought them back because it was on the it was on the playstation it was a great game i was just excited that i was excited because i did it i'm going to say correctly the first time meaning that i flipped the castle without knowing what i was doing like i didn't we didn't really pay attention to walkthroughs back then. And you certainly weren't going to go look it up online unless you had a computer, which I didn't. Um, 
we didn't have money for things like computers at that time. Or my family didn't. Yeah, that game was a lot of fun. So, uh... It was one of those, like, I just happened to be wearing the right piece of gear when I came up against him, it, it came up against the Bellman at the top, and went, Oh. Okay, uh, yeah, so I, so there's a thing floating over his head, I should obviously kill that first. And then turns out that's what you need to do. Hey, look at this walnut, all this walnut I have. Uh, I should probably keep that. I might work on, uh, woodworking soon. <clears throat> Not today. Almost burn out your PlayStation playing that game. And I can believe that. Okay, so that's 19 more spaces free, so that's cool. Danny, do you know what profession makes a clear prism into a glamour prism, or do you. Or is that the one where you just have to get any profession to 50? Because I know there's a quest out in Mordona where you, like, get something, get one of your uh, professions up to 50, and then they start talking to you more about glamoring. Because I said the magic word, glamoring. I do have some glamour crystals. I have, like, 20, 25 of them. I just haven't used them. I have a lot of these quick tongue materials because I was saving them for because they give you spell speed I was saving them for my summoner and then I started streaming and I haven't really gotten on my summoner since then at least not a lot I have a little oh glamour prism is we is weaver that's awesome considering weaver is what I was already leveling He's only 30, though. Oh, no. <laughs> Sustasha. And this is what happens when you do leveling relay. This is the first dungeon you have to play, or that you have to go through. And it's part of the main story quest, so everybody has to go through it. Oh no, we're just going for it. Come on, minions. Prisms I've spent like 50 a day. Got only 356 bucks. But you spent 50 glamour prisms just today? So are you doing the, um, the original way of glamoring? Running out of space in the dress. Oh, okay. Because the guy I watched the video for said there was, he did the, 
he was talking about the update to it with 4 four three I think it was no four three is just out or just coming out four two four two five whatever the li latest one they put in um this, this guy on YouTube does a lot of he he's all about his clamoring and he was reviewing the new version he was saying how like the old version still works you can still use it um, but the new version with the dresser oh okay I get it some gear you can't put in the dress because they're not soul bound on the characters so you have to carry them okay yeah because I know he was saying there was uh there was some stuff that he was he was gonna end up actually probably doing like a combination of the old and new methods because apparently 200 slots was not enough space for him for all of his glamoring stuff. I think you would like him. life? Yeah. Yeah, this, this guy does a lot of glamoring too. He absolutely loves glamoring. Um, I'll have to look up his name. I'm subscribed to him on YouTube. Oh, actually, uh, if you follow my YouTube, uh, you can see it under the channel that I'm subscribed to. It, it starts with an M. Um, I think it's, um, uh, Muriel. Uh, but he does a lot of update videos. I don't think he's a streamer. But he does, a uh, he does a fair amount of videos that are about different different things of glamour? Oh, have you seen the, um... Have you seen the T-Rex mount yet? <laughs> it looks awesome. I want one, but I don't know how to get it. And I think that would require me to do current content. is like hot breath. <laughs> Yay, my healer knows how to damage and heal. She's amazing. Makes them angry. Kind of the point. Okay, blue. Yes. Push the button. Push the button. 
Hello, kitty. One of the best players in the world. Uh, best one yet. Yuria Tsukamori. Okay. Can I catch him on YouTube or is he on Twitch? Both. He sounds cool. Even if, even if I can't understand what somebody's saying. Um, I can still understand what's going on in the game. He's on YouTube? Okay. I'll have to look then. <clears throat> I've been looking for other people that play 14. Um, like if you ever see my stream after I'm done, if you're if you still sit here, uh, I post Sophie every night. This is all she does on Twitch. She plays 14 from 9 p.m. East, well, Eastern time. Uh, 9 p.m. until like sometime between 2 and 4. It's too early for me, or it's too late in the morning, in the, in the evening for me, but that's because I work at 6 o'clock in the morning. Third for Baka games. Cry in the chat. <laughs> Okay. Oh, it's right, it's Thursday. Thursday means critical rolls on a 10 o'clock. Not that I watch it. I can't watch it live, they go for like four hours of D&D. &D. Everything. Oh. <laughs> Don't try to pick up the key while there's still a mob going. Thought he was dead. She was dead.
Let me see here. Mioni. Oh, Danny. Mioni is the guy you're looking for. But yeah, if you go to, uh... If you go to my YouTube and then look for Mioni, um, he does a lot of... He does a lot of, like... Or at least a fair amount of, like, fashion-y... Well, not necessarily fashion -y, but, like, glamour videos. As well as update videos. Nine appeared in your bathroom. Are you playing Pokemon Go? <laughs> Where do you live that you get an Arcanine in your house? <laughs> I haven't even seen an Arcanine. Well, I also, to be fair, I also stopped playing Pokemon Go. Um, because my You need one level to get to 40 on your monk. Woo! 48. I learned the ability Shirk. Oh, you're max level in Pokemon Go, okay. And when I stopped, I was like 22. Because we had, uh, we hit winter. So for a while, I was still turning it on every now and then. Um. But then. My phone is super old and has, well, not super old. It's like five years old. Um, but it's been getting battery issues, so I got rid of Pokemon Go because, well, it's a battery drain as it is. But my battery drain's just normally not doing anything super, super quick now. So till I get a new phone, no more Pokemon Go.
Hit everything! Hydra Ball! Yeah, I've never seen Arcanine. I had, um... I had a Growlithe. iPhone 10 battery. Oh, okay. So yeah, probably the iPhone 8. Yeah, I have, um... I have a Galaxy S5. <laughs> so... I've had it for four or five years. So it's... It's been good. I mean, to last that long, a modern phone to last that long is actually a pretty good thing, but, um, yeah, the last couple months or so, it basically, I can go to sleep with it 100% and it'll drop to 50 by the time I wake up six hours later to get up for work. So, it is what it is. It's not dead yet, so 